Hey DJ, give me something really stupid. Like that. Just like that, yes. ding dong day. That's right. Ladies and gentlemen, shuffle up a ding dong day here with another diary, volume two. This is Mr. Scent. And I would like to start off by showing you the sky at All Boers Mountains. Is it not amazing? It is so amazing that I don't know what's going on. In fact, I'm going to sit on this truck for a minute or two and just, you know, uh, you know, sit on the truck. Um, today we will be having some parachuting skills like those over there. Please enjoy my diary, volume two. <laughs> so, uh, this is Albor's Mountains. Uh, if you haven't played here before, um, it's pretty neat. There's a lot of rocks because of the mountains. Watch me scope in on this another time. Hey, wait for it. It's going to happen again. Hey, but this guy is going to get shot in the neck because he did that stupid bunny hopping move, which I don't enjoy. I will be drinking a lot of caffeine today, so if you don't mind, just skip the next 30 minutes of this video, and then you'll be halfway there. Hey. Where'd your cranium go? I'm not sure. But it's somewhere on the snow. Cover the mountains of Alborz. The brightest map ever invented by DICE. With the exception of all the other maps. If you understand what I'm saying, I'm being a jerk. Anyways, let's continue to look at the scoreboard and totally dodge that, uh, dart. Oh, this is gonna be in a montage. It is. Look at, did you see that invisible bullet I shot at his face? Probably not, because it was invisible. If you said yes, you're stupid. Now, this guy's going to run underneath the truck because he is actually a mechanic, not a scout. If you thought I was lying, you would be incorrect. We are going to continue looking down here at nothing for about 13 to 14 seconds. I'm going to time it just right. Watch, guys. Watch. Watch. Look at the big map. If you haven't noticed, you can uh, do this by typing typing M. You type M by pressing M on the keyboard, which displays the map at a bigger scale. You're gonna get shot. Maybe. Yep. There's one. There's one in the cankle. Cankle and another invisible bullet to your scrotum. It's gonna say head, but scrotum is better. Bunny hopping for the win. Why am I looking up at this guy? I'll tell you why I'm looking up at this guy. Because there's a lot of snipers in here, and they deploy spawn beacons. Spawn beacons lets you spawn in from the air. A.K.A. look up once in a while. This poor guy doesn't get dead. And this guy right here is lucky to be dead. But not by me. Good sniping skills by teammates. Thank you. If you're wondering why I don't move around at all, it's because I really don't know this map. Because there's so many bleeping rocks that I don't know where to run. And if you're not using some type of urban camo, like I have on, then you're not elite. You're not elite sniper. A elite. Is it elite or an elite? Somebody correct me. Okay, so if you notice, all the action is not on your video screen at this point, but it will get a little better, I promise you that. Watch me jump. Look at that, guys. You see that jump? Pretty amazing. Pretty amazing stuff right there. Look at my khakis. They are so dog baller that I'll just drink some more Coca-Cola out of my coffee mug. It's not Coke. It's actually, uh, I'm looking at it. It's pumpkin spice coffee. This guy is going to kill my teammate and then get shot in the ribs. 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 Rib shot. And if you heard that noise, that was an arrow whizzing by my head. So what do you do when you are getting shot by an Indian? What do you do? Run like a mother... You know what I'm saying? You run. Because if somebody's bringing a crossbow to a gunfight, you know that it's going to be crazy. Am I right, guys? <laughs> uh, yeah, inappropriate laughter. I'm not really sure where the enemies are, but I can tell they're in that direction somewhere. I'm really just a butt hurt guy today. Um, I do shoot this guy, but I saw the other sniper too, and I was thinking I could get away. But really, good shot by him. 
because I was just in the in the open there. And uh, I'm gonna do a little spin move here. A little spin move. Try to land softly on my supple tush. And that's another thing I gotta say. Other than ranking on dice, which I probably shouldn't because I play this game too much. This really is a pretty map, I have to say. This is a pretty map. I like the way it looks. And honestly, I think that more maps should be, or I'm sorry, more TDM maps should be uh, kind of in this kind of format, like out in the open. It's just, it just feels more natural, like a natural setting. And I had no idea where this guy was because he, he was blending in so well there. Shot him in his shin, but apparently he had shin guards on, so I do the old sentence spin. And the sentence spin is playing stupid. But you're not really playing stupid. It's kind of like rope a dope. Three men in a tub. Sniper rifle metal. That's because I play sniper too much. You can see how noobish I am. I can't get up these rocks because I apparently uh, think I can get up there, but obviously I can't, so. We're probably going to try to get more footage this way, over here. I'm going to show you a little trick I learned called snipe the other guy in the face. Look at that. Those two guys were trying to make love, and you know what? They were denied. Look at this guy juking me. That's what happens when you juke. You fall down a... F There's another arrow, guys. Run like hell. Native Americans with crossbows. Did you see that phoenix rising from the ashes? You probably saw that. Yeah, it's pretty freaky. Freaked me out when I was playing. I was like, look at me! I'm a crossbow guy. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know why I even do any commentary. Because probably... Watch this, watch this, ready? In three, two, one. I fooled you, nothing's going on here. Oh, swing and a miss, strike one. Strike. No. Blake got killed a lot in this round, by the way. If you haven't noticed a kill feed, poor guy. He's probably a good player, but I just was shooting him in the face too much. Let's be getting shot. This is a very bad encounter. I don't know, I don't know what happened. But if you notice, I did get the shot off there, but he still, he probably had extended his elbow out two inches farther than his wiener. And that probably stuck me right where the sun doesn't, never mind. I'm gonna try to redeem myself here. Let's see, uh, let's see what happens. So what you do is you put your spawn beacon down, up do, and you wait for bunny hoppers to jump into you like light. And uh, the problem with bunny hopping is it's lame, it looks stupid, and it gets you shot in the gut. Uh, yeah, that's right, you got shot in the gut. And the kill feed's really rife with really, really nasty stuff, so I'll let you guys be the judge whether or not you think it's appropriate behavior. Because for one, I don't appreciate behavior like that. Teammates all abound, no one shooting no one. Oh, by the way, this is a crossbow sniper knife only, I believe, um, and it really, it really gives you some interesting gameplay. Everybody's dying, and I'm missing completely. I'm just not used to, yeah, exactly, so many. I'm just not used to this map, and it's, it's interesting having, uh, that's me listening to the L96 because nobody uses the L96 anymore. Just sounds really good. I keep on thinking it's an enemy, but it's really not. And Frodo goes down. I'm sorry, Blight. My bad. B Light 92. Also, what the hell happened there? Dot com. And that is really rude behavior on Nut Splash's part. I don't condone his violence nor his mouth, especially on a game rated mature I mean what the hell is up with server rules saying no swearing when the game uh, the avatars in the game they even say really bad things like 
Well, you guys know what I'm talking about. Like, I'm getting my bleep pushed in. I'm not even going to say it because I feel bad saying it. But if you can hear that in your server, what is the problem with swearing? I don't get it. The game is rated M for mature. So if you're not mature enough to hear swears or see them, Enemy maybe you Over. should be playing another game. Like, uh, Jeopardy. So anyways, transition words abound, my friends. <laughs> transition words abound. <sighs> this gameplay is really terrible. I'm very sorry. I know it's boring you. Uh, but this is all, really the only footage I... I haven't really recorded it the past month, other than Borderlands. If you guys want to see some Borderlands stuff, this is a funny encounter. Very funny. Nobody, nobody knows what's going on. Get shot! Get shot, dude! Hey! Oh, yeah, you want some of this? Watch this. Lick my... Push it in your... Shout out to my friend Chicago Wind X. Also known as something else. I'm not going to let you know what it is because... We're friends now, and you're not allowed to know his real name. <laughs> um, like I was saying before, this map is very pretty. I'm very, I'm very immersed in it. It's very immersive, and because of that, I, I don't play the same. Like, uh, I find that if there's a, if it's the, if the environment is very, uh, what's, let's say. Uh, I'm going to use the word again, immersive. I tend to play very, very slow and not really aggressive. I don't know what it is. It just makes me feel more better. Makes me feel more better, guys. This is the greatest commentary I've ever made besides the first one. Good shooting on my part. Good shooting. Or the hips. Hip fire right in the groin. This guy, I'm gonna, I don't know why he's using that, so I throw a grenade in his ball sack. In the ball sack, over the rim, through the net, over the river, in your mom's. That's quite rude, and I apologize for my behavior tonight, guys. Um, the coffee I had was probably laced with caffeine. Anyways, hope you guys had a great time. I uh, just stapled two of my fingers together, so I'm going to go seek a medic. Have a great one. Love you.